packing the jungle for the last regular season game. And WLWT News 5's Danielle Dendak is live right now. She continues our team coverage with reaction from all kinds of fans now locked in on those playoffs. Hi there, Danielle. Yeah, my coin flip who all those coins are now off the table because the Bengals came in with their claws out ready to take control of this playoff destiny for them. And let me doubt, just tell you who Day Nation showed out. It was a sea of black and orange down here. Not only was Paycor electric, but the banks were electric. We heard screams from every single direction. But after this past week, today's win was so needed for so many reasons. Everyone is thankful Tamar Hamlin is on the road to recovery. But let me tell you, a lot of fans were flipping out over the possible coin toss in the new playoff rules. Now, Houday Nation never feared saying no one wants to play us. You don't want to play us. You don't want to play us and you don't want to play us here. This atmosphere, 70,000 people going nuts in that stadium. This is a jungle. And this is where it's going to happen. So much excitement down here, and we'll have much more for you coming up later on at 10 and 11. Let me tell you, one of the biggest things that fans were talking about and even reenacting was that coin flip. So I'll bring that for you guys later coming up tonight. But if next week is anything like tonight, you might even want to bring your earplugs to the jungle because it was that loud. Reporting live here at Paycor Stadium, Danielle Tindak, WLWT News 5. All right.